Hey guys, welcome to the DMX Show. I'm your host Shane, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the new application FoxFi. I say new, it's been on the market now for about a month and a half, two months. Uh, what this does is it allows you to have free wireless tether uh, on any Android device. Uh, minus HTC devices and some Motorola devices. So all your Samsung, LG, most of your Motorola devices, this will work. Uh, the developers of FoxFi are working on uh, the ability to use this on HTC devices. Uh, but for now, there's something, I guess, uh, a form in the kernel that is prohibiting them from uh, being able to use it. So anyhow, very simple, no root required. The way that I found this is... Uh, my brother-in-law bought a new phone, 4G, and he wanted to tether it up to his computer, and he didn't want me to root it. So some people are comfortable with root, others are not. Fox 5 is the perfect solution for anybody. So all you have to do here is open it up. You have some settings here. You can change your network name. Uh, if you wanted to customize that, you can change your password so that you're the only one that can log on. I have a very simple password there. I'm sure anybody could guess it. Uh, you, can do the, you can also do Bluetooth. Hotspots, uh, but if we want to do the Wi-Fi hotspot, just click activate. It's going to activate that hotspot. You'll see it there in the status. Uh, we'll go ahead and get over to the computer so that I can turn that on. Uh, so we should be able to find that here. Let me disconnect from my home network. And then we'll connect to the Android Wi-Fi hotspot. So we'll connect to another network. And there it is, Android 72. It's going to ask me for my password, so I'll go ahead and put that in. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Connect. That should connect pretty easily. And then we'll do a speed test so that you can see that we're on the blazing 4G speeds. Uh, one thing that I have noticed is that it takes several minutes to get a good full connection. Like if you look down here, we're already uh, at local only. So it will take one or two minutes to actually get a good solid connection there. Takes longer than hooking up to your router at home anyways. Connection unsuccessful. Okay, let's try to open up the web browser. Looks like we've got a, a good connection here. Okay, Android 72. So we are connected on Android 72. We'll go to speedtest.net and check out our speed. Okay, so begin the test. I was clicking on an ad. Oh, that's so stupid. I feel dumb. Anyhow, don't click on the ad. So we're getting about, looks like 6.65 megabytes per second down. And looks like about one megabyte per second up, which is not bad. That's better than my Wi-Fi at home. Uh, through at and I'm getting about three megabytes down and half a megabyte up. So that's a little better. Anyhow, that is uh, FoxFi for your Android device.